Hi, unfortunate friends, and we are back for another episode. I'm just gonna hand in these the these quests. Uh, we'll get that ring. Is more Good. Uh, any of this? Good. I don't know. Problem is, I don't know what's <laughs> what's good. Um, All right. So if anybody's unsure, by the way, the government has basically told people to stay away from other people, and by the looks of it, they're not doing what they're being told. So, in my case, if if you get it at this point, it's your own fault. Like my my dad, he has no immune system, so um, I have to basically just stay away from him, like all the time. Like I I, I can't be anywhere near my own dad. Um, which sucks and it also means I can't be anywhere near my friends either because if they get it and then they pass it to me and then they give it to my dad he'll get the worst version of it like me I'll just get the you know uh, hopefully um, it does say you know it's a lesser percentage of a chance of you getting it but just because we're young doesn't mean we're not gonna get the worst version of it So it's just like, you know, and it says there's a heat wave coming. I just got text from one of my mates. And it's like, I bet any money they're going to blame Boris now for what's going on. And it's like, yeah, no shit. Like, basically saying he's not being clear about it, but I'm pretty sure he is being clear about it. It's not, it's not rocket science. Stay away from each other. I don't know what you have to be more clear about on that. I don't know, it just, it just makes me angry. You know, to see people like this. I know I wouldn't really talk about it, but it's just... You know, it directly affects me and my family. And it's like, you have these people who ban it by. And stuff like that. And you have the... Um, the Secretary of State coming out saying, oh yeah, well there's 1.7 million that people basically bought and now are stuck inside their houses. Then you have the media going up, trying to like scare everybody by saying, oh, is there a future? Is there a future? Just, no, there's not. It's just because fuckers keep panic buying. And I can understand why the panic buying, but there is no reason to. You just buy when you need to. Just because you're isolated doesn't mean you're not going to get anything. No, you just contact a friend or somebody who who can be out, and they'll get it for you. You know, if I could speak to a um, an MP, I'd tell them. You know, contact some. Uh, you know, famous YouTubers that are inside of Britain, and tell them, you know, let you let you let young the younger generation know what what's the what's the deal. You know, because politics doesn't know the internet. They have very little clue of how much power you know influential people have over it. And if you thought of somebody like PewDiePie. If he went around and told everybody, yeah, well, this is what you're going to do, blah, 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 people would listen. Well, you would think they would listen, but... Yeah, that's it, blame Deathlink. It's all Deathlink's fault. No, it just it just makes me angry that people can, you know, just panic in such a stupid way. 
it's like it's like my father. He's he, even though he's he's isolating, he, he's not panic buying. He's not gonna have a, a ton of stuff because he knows he's got me. So he just knows. Oh right, well if I need something, he can go get it. It's as simple as that. You sh just stop being stupid about it. It ain't difficult. What are you afraid that the Br that Britain's gonna you know introduce martial law? I highly doubt it. At most, all they're gonna do is in you know um, they'll probably do a curfew like they have done in America. That is about it. Solve that. Uh, we need to find that crackhead who don't don't you know say anything bad, but you know he is a crackhead, right? You know he's clearly addicted to some sort of drug, and he needs help. Let's just wait for him. Anything new? Like uh, basically every day, I'm look I'm listening to the news when I come back from work. It's just like, you know, what what's the newest information? Just so I can better protect my own family from myself. It's like I don't know if anybody watched the the BBC thing or whatever when it was live, but the secretary say they had the health secretary there as well, and he basically just said, you know, if you do what we we tell you to do, you, it's potentially saving a life, and you're not bloody fucking wrong about it. Anyway, ran over back to World of Warcraft. Don't know, like, cool. I just look sexy. Yeah. Mischievous face. Drop a nuke on him. Uh -huh. It clouds my judgment. I hope you can see beyond my tattered robes and desperate behavior. I am not a monster. Watch, I, I shall prove it to you. I am not just some man adult freak like the rest of those wretches. Who is this? Uh -huh. I am called Rufus. Son of Indoril, formerly of Sudoval. Pleased to make your acquaintance. I do not trust you and your kind. I'm a nightborn enough, but they seem. Uh, let's come with it. My people. Uh, what time am I on? Eight minutes. Off to see all my friends and family. And loved ones. <laughs> to kill them, of course. To kill them. <laughs> I love it. Not me, though. My discipline is iron. Oh, mana crystal. Just for you. See, crackhead. That's all you talk about. So, why are you here, Mizuna friend? Just visiting your wife. Has this one ever stopped? My apologies, good dragon. Oh, look, we are here. Uh, 
get some health back. I wasn't looking. I wasn't liking that. Are Thank you. Because they can actually Enough of that. Thank you. Die, please. Peace out. Uh, let's drop that on you. Drop that on you. Drop that. Oh, no. Too far away. Drop that on you. Die, please. Picking off my lieutenants? I suppose you think you're clever. Ah, shit. Yeah, go ahead and please. Uh, bye. He's out. I don't want anything to do with that. <laughs> 14 minutes of recording yet. That's not too bad. Uh, I should level up soon. And as they do not trust Nightfallen. Did that dragon send you interloper? Or was it that beggar Brutus? No matter. Soon you will all kneel before Azuna's new prince! You is the one thing to mm -hmm. But if you deceive me, Wait, prepare to what are you doing? My siphons! You low-born dirt! You don't know who you're dealing with!
deal with that one. And now the last one. Done. Level. Now you. So we do this. This. Drop that on you. Just let the minions fight in there. I'm in the mountains. No, no, they're everywhere. You know, she could just use the Hang fire on. breath there. We're going in low. No nope, fire breath. That thing you use. You got magic. Right, best thing to do here is attack these things because they're on autopilot for Kaggar. Watch it, and then Kaga. Pop. Pop. Kaga. Right, let's go. Fight. Nobody attack me. Why aren't you uh, being taunted? Don't like that. Uh, 
you. Hi, how you doing? You gonna die? Oh, crack, 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 crack. Come on, we'll get this done and then we'll end the video. 107. I'm sure you can get the heritage armor at 110. I don't know why I went to 120 uh, on the warrior. I'll have to double check. What's that done? Okay, we'll just speed run out of. Um, ropes. Come back in one. Uh, still a ghost. You want to get in there anytime soon? Time to go find the crack boy. Okay. Just bathing in a pool of crack. Consuming my very mind. Done. Now I go save him because he looks like he's just sucking the soul out of him. Surrender your power, dragon. These pools belong to the nightborn now. Help me. Uh, do you want to get aggro anytime soon, uh, buddy? <laughs> Bitch, what you get? There we go. And now to pick up quest. What quest is it? Uh we'll end the video there. Uh if you can leave a like, leave a like and if you can subscribe, subscribe. So I'll see you later. Bye. Tell me pretty lies. Look me in the face. Tell me that you love me, even if it's fake.